man hour uh, underscore buck. They said Debo Samuels has officially refollowed the San Francisco 49ers on IG. Does this mean that Debo Samuels is over his little tyrant, stop being a baby, and he is staying in San Francisco? I think uh, I think way on this one because it did seem like Debo was going to get moved. It really seemed, especially like on draft night. But once I saw he didn't go through on day one and then day two really was when I knew like, okay, you know, there's not really a shadow of a doubt that he's not going to, you know, get traded or anything. I think he, I think that he's working it out with, with San Fran. I think they're, they're piecing the puzzle together and trying to trying to work through this. I think he, he likes San Francisco a lot. He wants to stay there. And I think San Francisco really likes having a versatile playmaker like him on their team. So they want him to stay there. So I think they're, I think they're going to try and work this out. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I have to go on the side of weight as well. Um, uh, who's your general manager? John John Lynch, right? Is our general man manager? I can't. I think so. Yeah, uh, the safety for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and John. Like I, I respect John Lynch so much as a player and now even a GM because he flat out said that we are not trading him, we are not moving him. He is our he is our guy, and he seems like a very straight edge, very straightforward, no smoke and mirrors type of guy. So. At first, I was like, ah, can you really leave him in the locker room? Because you know why we what we talked about this last like this la- last week, right? Like if he drops a game winning pass, is it pointed to hey, he does he he doesn't want to be here, so he's sabotaging the team type of thing. And I and I think you are white. I like I like I think like he he got his little tyrant over, right? He threw his little child fit and now he's a professional athlete again. And now it is time to ball. It is time to make some money. And guys, let's just, let's just be honest. The San Francisco 49ers are still a really, really damn good team. They have been the two yep. NFC championship games the last three seasons. The only, the only, the only reason why they didn't go in 2020 was because they were COVID. So, so they had to play all their home games in Arizona or something like something like that, right? They, they literally had every starter on their team miss at least two games or more. So, I mean, yeah, they were in, they were so injury riddled yeah. that year. I remember that. It was every, like, was it a was tough everybody. Year for them. Yeah. So, I mean, the 49ers are still a damn good, damn good team. 